everyone, it's Sarah again for our last part of our series for cross training for the marathoner. This one is going to be so beneficial. Great cross training tool because balance is key to make sure you are using the proper muscles when you are running. So once again, let's get to it. Start by just bending those knees nice and soft. Little squeeze of the glutes. Hands just at your belly. You're going to try and close your eyes. If you have a bar in front of you and you don't feel comfortable, place your hands on the bar. If you don't want to close your eyes, don't close your eyes. But just bend those knees, have a soft bounce. And you're just gonna rock a little bit to one side and then the other. And while you're doing this, make sure your shoulders are relaxed. Can you feel the fire in your belly? I know I can. Belly buttons lifting up and in to keep me nice and tall. And just keep going now, one side to the other. Little bend in the knee, you never want to lock. To feel really nice and light and just add a little arm movement. Think you're moving with intention. What's your intention today? Is it, I want to have perfect form. I want to get stronger. I want to be the best marathoner in the world. Whatever it is, find that intention and use that through this practice today. Super simple, right, movement-wise, but it is really challenging to keep your arms nice and long. Push down to the heels. Articulate through the feet. Keep moving, walk the feet in, and use those abs just a little bit more. Now just pull one hand in and one hand out. Make little fists, don't lock the fists. It's like you have two hard boiled eggs in your hands and you're just using that to propel you forward without holding too much tension in the knuckles. In four, three, we're gonna return to a bounce in two, and one, and find that nice bounce. Just breathe here. Roll those shoulders back on one side. Hands are at your hips, and you're going to lift it up. Now, you might fall out of it like I just did, so what I want you to do is just think toes are relaxed, and if it's in your heel, that's okay, it can be there too. We're gonna lift up from your abs. Breathe. Inhale through the nose, exhale through the mouth. Find your breath. Two, and one. Press out, gently bring it down, shake it out, and then let it go. Thank you guys so much for coming and working out with me. It has been a great series and I hope you continue your practice. Keep watching, you'll just get stronger and stronger. Thank you guys, I'm Sarah, have a great one.